Well, we've already got some changes for Lakeshore at Maine. So I don't know if you saw my video I put up about two weeks ago, but Lakeshore at Maine here in Lakewood Ranch uh, is a new condo complex that's coming right here outside the Michael Saunders office. This development has already made a change in the fact that they're taking out some of the units to make the ones that are in the condo complex larger. So where there were going to be only four penthouses, now there's going to be eight. And the first uh, few weeks that it went up, the first few days actually that it went up, um, the top floor was already reserved. So the other day we had Mark Hughes that works with the developer for Lakeshore at Maine came to our office and gave us a presentation. And I videotaped that so you could hear it directly from them as to what's going to be happening and what's going on. So let's take a look and see what he has to say. Don't buy real estate if you experience allergic reactions to happiness, satisfaction, pride, fulfillment, contentment. Stop buying real estate if you don't like community, a sense of belonging, a diversified portfolio. Buying real estate may cause you to shop at hardware stores, furniture stores, and design centers. See your realtor immediately if you experience any of these symptoms. So uh, Mark Hughes, uh, Adam Miara uh, is a partner of mine, and uh, many of you know Albert uh, Miara, Adam's father. He's another partner. And uh, we are going to put some buildings up here on the dog park. And uh, Adam reminded me it's also a parking lot, I guess, on first Fridays. So, <laughs> so uh, uh, I think you'll find interesting. We had slated uh, 38 units uh, for uh, two buildings with a pool in between. Uh, many of you uh, saw the plans a couple years ago when it first got jump started. Uh, and then a couple things happened uh, and it got taken off the agenda, if you will. So we're putting up uh, four floors, uh, three residential floors over parking, uh, 16 units now in each building. Um, we um, reconfigured over the last couple weeks. Uh, the demand has actually been for larger units. And so where originally we had had 750, 1,950, and then we had um, some um, penthouses that were 3,500 square feet, those went right away in terms of reservations. So uh, 32 units going up, two buildings, uh, there'll be a pool with cabanas uh, in the middle, um, very high-end construction. So these are luxury units. We expect a very high-end first level of finish, uh, and we'll have those rolled out probably again in, in about six weeks or so. We'll have those so that you can kind of touch and feel and see what the Base finish is going to be, we expect about two levels of finishes over that, and then uh, certainly you can go crazy above that if you'd like, um, but we'll give, uh, we expect about three levels. Appliance packages we don't have yet. Those are the kind of the things, sorry, I'm getting off the screen here. Those are kind of the things that you usually have from a builder when you come out of the ground and go vertical. Uh, we, we expect to go vertical in about three months, so you'll see some activity out here in the fall. Uh, and then we expect to finish up the project and be uh, moving people in probably Christmas of 22, early 23. So it's usually about 18, 16 months and we're kind of underway now. The builder is, uh, the developer is Frank D'Agostino out of Tampa. 12 foot ceilings on the fourth floor, 10 foot ceilings on uh, two and three. The, the penthouses have uh, closed garages underneath. The uh, rest of the units have two parking spots underneath. Uh, there is um, gas, so gas cooking will have um, uh, uh, tankless water heaters um, that will be um, very secure downstairs. We'll have uh, doors to get in the garage and out. You'll have fob access or keypad access up the elevators and into the building. Uh, although this is a very safe area <laughs> compared to where I've been uh, in LA and New York over the last decade. So uh, questions, uh, Pam said you may have questions. Price sure. Point. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Uh, price point, $400 a square foot is probably the best way to look at this project. So 1950 square feet, um, high, uh, high eights, nines, uh, Penthouses got reserved at 1.6, 1.5, 5, uh, and 1.5. All so three bedrooms, three baths, all. all. So, um, and then the penthouses were four, three and a halfs, 
I expect the, the new penthouses, the reconfigured penthouses to still be three threes, uh, but I'm waiting on the architectural rendering. Great, uh, fitness uh, center inside from the swimming pool. And you can see those on the schematics on the web, uh, but uh, normal fitness, um, but no business center. The cabanas are cool. Uh, so there's uh, 9, 18 cabanas for 32 units. So that's first come, first serve on those. The top floor all get cabanas, and those just have electric. They don't have baths or. So we've got uh, eight reserved, uh, and a lot of people waiting on the new reconfigurations. So we expect that number to increase as soon as I get my hands on the new uh, architectural renderings. So uh, it's five thousand dollars, fully refundable to reserve a unit. Gives you the right to go to contract in two and a half to three months when we go to contract. Uh, you can get out at any time, you can get out at that time. So at contract, you'll put 10% down, another 10% will be due in 30 days, and your th last 10% of your 30% total down will be due in another 30 days. So it's 30% total down, over the first 60 days after you go to contract. Yeah, I think we're probably targeting on the, the lower units, uh, the, the smallest unit at 1950, about 700 a month. Uh, but that could go up, could go down, but you know how that works. Good question, thank you. Uh, so right now, and the, the HOA docs are finished, they're just being approved. Um, right now it's three month minimum, two times a year, and, but possibly four times a year. Great, uh, thank you. So two, uh, two dogs, 60 pound minimum combined. Perfect. Anything else? Thank, thank you, you very much. Thank you. Perfect, thank We're you. We're right there, thanks. So now that we have the current update on what's going on here at Lakeshore at Maine, I'm gonna put a link down below so that as the developments come up, you can get notified and as brochures become available and, and more floor plans, I'll be able to keep you updated on this project. And you know, this is gonna be a very convenient place for a lot of folks because we are right here at downtown Main Street in Lakewood Ranch. So you're gonna have the shops, the restaurants, um, everything is gonna be local. The hospital is directly across the street and Publix isn't too far to get your groceries. You could probably walk to the Publix from here. So I think that this is going to be a really great place for um, people to be. Even though it's not going to be quite as large a complex as what they originally designed, I think the lucky people that, be, that are going to be here will uh, enjoy it quite a bit. If you get value out of this video, just click that little like button and the subscribe button so that every time I put up a new video, you'll be notified. Mark Bamig, Michael Saunders and Company.